It was kind of low volume, right? Yeah. All right. I told you one matchup I don't want to face, and what do I face? Smile. Because here you just get infinitely frozen, right? Elulun. For Elun. Any Eluluns here? People say coining this is kind of not great most of the time, right? So let's keg bait. Damage he deals here is not that relevant because very often we just heal it back anyway in the early game. So I think the way is you go palm reading, then this is two mana, one mana, you play that the turn after, and then you probably go popping off. I already have a gift. I'm thinking split might be better to get bigger things. I think I want to still take it and have an extra spell. So next turn we go inside. Depending if the inside draws the Nasmani, we already go next turn. Man, now it's also three mana. That's a man. Huge man. Next turn this, this, and then we pop right here. Yeah. We have a solid hand. I think I like the silence. It's also very playable. All right, are you ready guys for the APM speed momentum now? three already I'm actually very low I might just die But he's just gonna go Avalanche, right? And we are getting wrecked. I guess I hope he doesn't have Avalanche. Oh, he has only five mana. I should have played this. It was actually a pretty big deal. We need to kill him next turn because the turn after I'm dead. I no, I should never bless there. Bless can make me lose, right? It's never bless. Oh, is he gonna bloom it? Oh my god, Bloom Avalanche. I need to silence my own melee to then make it 30 or something. 
I mean, he instantly went face, guys. Isn't this the most obvious balloon into... Otherwise, he never goes face there. Yeah, of course you do it, sir. What is he thinking about? Holy moly. <laughs> that is amazing. I mean, he just has Macau and we're still wrecked, right? Or can we stall enough? I want to do this next turn. I'm not that scared here. Why so slow? I mean, we have all the time now to think, right? This is actually a very important turn. I think we uh, save this for one more turn because he's probably going to go Macau or Snowfall Guardian again and then we do it. And then we just hope he doesn't have the additional freeze. Yeah, I could silence, I guess. That was playable. I mean, I'm expecting at least one, but maybe even as two more things. Do we think he has another Snowfall Guardian and another Macau? Hum, 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 hum. I mean, gotta be another Snowfall Guardian, right? Avalanche! This guy, man. Roping them Snowfall Guardians. If I silence their three trees, I can kind of kill them well. And then I save this in case he has another Macau. So I think we do this. Next time we do this. I mean, if he has another Macau, right? That's what we're worried about. I mean, we even beat last Macau now, I think. Now he can't even Macau. He can like go one mana freeze, maybe. I mean, now you're drawing. That ain't the Macau you want. Guys, I think we won. I think we won, we won, we won, we won, we won, we won, we won. Now you're playing fast, huh? When you have the obvious Snowfall Guardian, you're taking your time, but now panic mode on. And there, Ty sneaking the victory. Who is this man? It looked very grim, but Ty is finding a way out here in the matchup against Shaman. Glory. 
What is Glory playing? Is he Pepka Priest? Or is he Miracle Priest? I pass. Your turn. I can actually use this to get like a better card, right? A lot of uh, people are doing it like this sometimes. So you get this spell reduced. Ah, maybe it's wrong. He's a rogue? No, I don't think so. This is gonna be a strange matchup, right? Like, when do you pop off? I don't really have a hand to pop off, I have no draw. I think we just wait. I mean, I kind of feel I need the silence in case he pops off. Is a mirror just about who goes second in a pop-off? I mean, silence doesn't do everything. That's a bit of the problem, right? Kona with the 32 months in a row. Hope you're doing good. I mean, if you go, if the silence doesn't completely do everything, because there are still like big boys left, I think Meligos is like Omega key. I feel this is a typical priest uh, game, guys. I like how it's going. I feel like a priest main now. Hero power pass. Wait, he's meleeing for one card? What is this? Okay, I have no idea how to play this matchup, I guess. He's just doing it because of 412, right? What is this, man? Okay. I don't know man, this deck is so strange sometimes.
The animations, I still wanted to play this. No, that's the worst! Oh my god, this deck is so uh, not stressful as well. I wanted to play this, I think. I don't know, man, how to play a freaking mirror. I guess whenever you pop off, guys, don't discover. Because it takes like 15 seconds before you even have like... You can finally see or discover. Like you should pl keep some cards, right? I should have maybe kept the power word 42, it's a bit. But on the other side, you also kind of want to play your cards. Creating another melee. There's melee. Wait, I won? I literally passed six turns in a row. I went in, no idea what to do and I won. So I think my, okay. The way I sequenced it was not correct. I of course could have sequenced it better. But I guess the way you play this matchup is you kind of don't go Till you draw melee, or you have a way to find melee, which I did because I discovered a horn, which always will draw melee because it was my last minion. And then you just pop off. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. And then you just hope he doesn't have melee. Lol. And I think you try to keep a little bit of buff spells because you're always going to get silenced. Which I strangely enough didn't do.